Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Yes, I'm in my living room. It is so freaking hot today. I did not want to sit at the patio table. I'm home alone. I don't have the kids today. Um, so I'm taking advantage of using the living room. I have the cooler on me. It's still really hot. But I wanted to go ahead and film a Dollar Tree haul for you guys. I did go today to two of them. And then I've been going just whenever I feel like going out or if the kids want to go. Um, <clears throat> I did need to go to get some more candy for my father-in-law. I don't know if sugar-free candy like got discontinued or if Dollar Tree is just not going to sell it anymore. But I can't find it anywhere. I looked at Walmart. I've looked at Vaughn's. So I was only able to find like the Werther's original and like some Russell Stover. But if you guys remember, I used to get my father-in-law like the butterscotch, uh, lemon, and like the assorted colored ones. He really likes those because they don't melt and he can leave them on his toolbox while he's at work. And I was trying to find those and they didn't have any. So I had to go to Dollar Tree to get a bag to put all of his stuff in. And then I did get him some sugar-free like vanilla wafer cookies and then just the three bags of candy that I was able to find, which is fine. It was enough for him. But anyways, this is a big haul. I'm going to save the fall stuff for the very end. So that way, if you are not interested, you could click off and you won't miss anything. There isn't really a whole lot, but... I didn't want to go crazy because I have already an, a lot of fall stuff um, and as always I have a bag right here so I can just put stuff in as I go. My big sunflower bar bag. So grab yourself a drink, grab yourself a snack and let's get into this Dollar Tree haul. As you can see I have stuff piled by me so I want to start with the food and the boring stuff like I always do and then we'll get into the really good stuff. I did need to get chicken broth. I did buy two. I already opened one. I needed it. So this one I'm going to go ahead and stick in the pantry so that way I have some. I also picked up a jar of pickles. These are just the kosher dills. Oh, and my husband loves kosher dills. So do I. I just got a small jar. And then I found this. This was on my wish list. I have had this before. I bought a big one at Costco. We already went through it. It was amazing. It's really good on toast and it's really good on bagels too. Um, like the cinnamon raisin bagels and then you put this on there. It's really good. So this is a small version of it. Um, it doesn't expire until December of this year, but this will not last. It's not very big. It is only 10 ounces and it's cinnamon toast crunch creamy cinnamon spread. So if you see this, don't pass it up. This is really good. Got one of those. And then I found these today in the like freezer section. I love soup dumplings. I love dumplings. I love um, pot stickers. I love all that kind of stuff. And these are steamed dumplings with chicken and vegetable. And the sauce is included, so it comes with a little sauce packet. You get six dumplings. It shows you right here all the different ways you can cook them. So I'm going to stick these in the freezer for a day where I don't really want to make anything for lunch. And I'm not that hungry, but these will fill me up. So I did get one of those. I think it was $3 because it was in the three section, like the plus. I did get one more bag of the Bitto Honey. I really do like these. They're really good. And then these Tic Tacs were so good, you guys. If you see these, grab them. They, they were amazing. The strawberry and cream. And then I just got the regular fruit adventure ones. Just the regular. So I got one of each of those. And then I found the family size Hot Wheels cereal. I didn't want to go crazy and buy too many, but um, I got this one for Leland because most of the time I find like girly ones or, you know, 
stuff like that and he always feels left out. So this time I found this one, he saw the box, he got really excited. I told him he has to wait till they finish what's on top of the fridge and then they can open this one. Um, it is a one pound box, 17.3 ounces and it doesn't expire until March of next year. So that has a really good shelf life on it. Um, maybe I will pick up another one the next time I go uh, just because the shelf life is really good on this but I want the kids to try it first and see if they like it and then if they do then I'll pick up another one but I got one of those and then I got <clears throat> some more Spanish rice because I am completely out I think I got three and I already used one so now I have two to put in my pantry because all I have is um, chicken and like cheddar broccoli. So I wanted to get two more of the rice. And then I thought I was gonna need these, but my husband ended up picking up like name brands, some name brand kind. So I ended up not opening these, but I'll just save them. I'll keep them in our medicine cabinet with everything. They're the vitamin C drops, you get 30. So I got one of those. I still sound sick. I'm not, it just won't go away. It's like lingering. Um, last like boring-ish thing, I got one more of the Suavitel fabric softener. This is the Hawaiian Escape. Sorry about that. My doctor was calling. So I did go ahead and pick up one more of these. I told you guys in my previous video, I like the yellow and the other one. I, like I said, I love both of them. They smell amazing. These do last me a good while because I don't use a whole lot since I add a bunch of my like beads and everything else, but a little goes a long way. I love the smell of this one and the other one and they just make your clothes and your bedding just smell amazing. Um, I have really dry skin on my, I have like a really dry face everywhere basically and a lot of my lotions I have one of these dermacells but they're not meant for your face they're it, it just says body cream and I've been using it on my face but this one is oil free daily facial cream with vitamin E so I wanted to try this one this is for the day they also had a nighttime one but I only picked up this one so I'm gonna start using this and see if it helps um, it says intense moisturizer for softer and smoother skin while relieving dryness. So I really hope I don't break out and I hope that it does help because right here on my cheeks, it gets really dry on my face and I'm hoping that this will help. So I did get one of those. I got Shannon another Barbie detangler. This stuff is amazing. I love the way it smells. Um, I do not like the shimmer and shine. I do not request that one or recommend that one. I mean, if you like it, that's fine to each their own, but it I don't like the way it smells and I don't like the way it leaves her hair. It's it's kind of hard to explain, but this one works perfectly. She loves the way it smells and it actually does work and it gets the tangles out of her hair cuz she's just like her mama. She has thick hair and it's really long. So, anything that can help while I'm brushing it. I'm all for it. So I did pick up another one of these because she's almost out. And then I did find the travel battery powered toothbrush. So I got this for myself. I'm going to show my husband and see if he wants one. And if he wants one, then I'll pick him up the, the navy blue one. Um, but I didn't want to get it for him if he doesn't want it. We don't normally use battery operated ones, but I actually want to try this one. And it says that it's soft, so I'm all about that. Um, it does not include batteries, but you only need one AAA battery. So I went ahead and got the pink one for me. And then, oh, real quick, I got two more dog bones for the shop dog at my husband's work. I can only find these at one of my Dollar Trees, so while I was there today, I picked up two of them. I think she still has one more, unless my husband already gave it to her, um, but she really likes these. So I got her two more while I was there, and my husband can just take them to work tomorrow if he wants. 
I did get a two pack of these bags, but I used one for my father-in-law. So this one I'll just save for if there's a birthday for a guy that we know or if I need it for my husband or Leland for his birthday or for anything. It's just an extra bag. It comes in a two pack, so I'll just save it with all my other stuff. And then I did get two folders. I mentioned in my Walmart haul that I got some at Dollar Tree. These are the ones that most of their teachers like because it has the class that I was talking about in the middle. So they can put important documents right here and then the kids can still put their homework in here or whatever they need. So I got unicorns for Shannon. I don't know if she's going to need this. Like I said, they didn't give a list out. They normally don't do that until school actually starts um, because Shannon's only going to first grade. I know Leland's going to need one because Shannon needed one for TK and for kindergarten. So I got him this one with all like the basketballs and the sports stuff on it. And oh, I just realized this is the wrong one. This doesn't have the little thingies. So he'll have to use this here at the house for pictures when he colors and stuff. Um, I need to get one like this that actually, I thought these were the same because they were in the same box, but that's okay. But she will definitely use this for school and she chose it. She chose the unicorns. Um, I actually might wait until I actually get a list of what the teacher wants and then I'll just go and pick up a folder. So that way I make, I make sure I buy the right one. Um, I don't know if you guys saw in a previous video, Dollar Tree haul, I picked up some crayons and I finally found the 30 count. So this has 30 count. So I'm gonna give these ones to the kids instead of those other ones. Cause you get more colors in here. You get 30 crayons. This one is Fruit Loops. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. So I'm gonna give this one to Leland and then I'll give the 30 count Care Bear to Shannon. So they can each have a new box of crayons to color with. <clears throat> Real quick, this is the basket I got for my husband for his goodie bag, goodie basket that I'm gonna make for him. Um, because I figured we could use this afterwards in our pantry, under the sink, in a closet, whatever, it's gray. I love the handles on it. I'm pretty sure everything will fit in this. Um, I'm gonna test it all out with the boxes because I wanna leave the boxes. I wanna leave everything in the boxes because I'm decorating the outside of the box. Um, and then once I give it to him, then obviously he can just dump everything in here and he doesn't have to use the boxes anymore. But when I hand him this, I need the boxes to fit in here, in this basket. And I looked at Dollar General and they didn't really have any big ones. So I got this one at Dollar Tree instead. And like I said, we will definitely use this afterwards. I'm thinking the pantry to organize the kids like chips and stuff. And then I got a small two pack of these ones for the pantry also because yesterday we were organizing the pantry and my husband asked if I had a basket and I told him no, we, we didn't have any extra. So I told him I would pick him up some. So, went ahead and got those. Just wanted to get those out of the way. I mentioned I was gonna pick up some more pens when I see new ones for when I go live with Ring Bombs. I'm hoping you guys will see this video today. If not, you will see it tomorrow. But I am going live tonight. Tonight, Today is Monday. I'm going live with Ring Bombs, or with Bomb Party stuff. I'm so excited. I've missed you guys so much. I can't wait to reveal these summer stacks and the earrings and all the new new rings that have been coming out have just been so gorgeous. Um, so I'm gonna save these with the other pens that I bought for when the goodie bag, um, the little raffle box, once I need to re put more stuff in there, I'll do pens. So now I have six, that should be enough. But these are really pretty. So they do have the big old diamond like usual but then it has little hearts. It's kind of hard to show you. Little silver hearts. So this one's like rose gold copper looking, but it has a pink diamond. And then a hot pink like purple pen. 
and then I got the blue one. So I have these three and then the three that I bought with the polka dots. There was a gold, a silver, and a rose gold. So that's what these are gonna be for. I'll save them for the next like batch of stuff that I need. And then I'm gonna save these for the next time too. Um, I might pick up two more, but I got two of the hot cold iPads in the cheetah print. They're both the same by Be Pure. And then I got two with the daisies. So I got those also to save for the next time I need stuff. Um, I went ahead and got these for Shannon for school. They're the by Goody and it's for medium hair. So they're just all black hair ties. These are the ones that I use. But I found these and I'm gonna keep these for myself. This is for thick hair. These are huge, you guys. Like those are some big hair ties um, and you get 10. So I got those for me. And then I found these, they're nail art dotting tools, but you can use these if you're doing a DIY or painting or anything like that. But I will be using these for my nails cause I do my own. Um, and I love that it's a three pack of little dotting tools and they're all different sizes. So I love that, found those. <coughs> Got some Hot Wheels. This one I'm gonna add in my husband's like goodie basket even though it's not food related, but I found him a new Batman Hot Wheel and it's just the Batmobile. They had a ton of new uh, Hot Wheels like this. They had like three different Batman ones. They had uh, Mr. Freeze. And it even shows you on the back, like they had all those. And then of course I got Harley Quinn for myself because I love her. And this one's called Gazelle GT and it says Harley on the car. So this one's for me, that one's for hubby. In our room, we do have like Batman themed stuff on our walls. And then <clears throat> Leland and Shannon already have this one, but I wanted to keep this one for myself because I love the cat from the Buzz Lightyear movie. Um, and his name is Socks. So I got this one for myself. They had all of those ones as well. And I think the kids got one, but they had already opened it, so I can't show you. Um, so got that. Getting down to the end here, so then pretty pretty quickly I'm going to be showing you fall stuff. I did get two, and Leland, I already opened one for Leland. He, I guess, needed to go up a size on his socks. Poor thing, all his socks were so small on him. So I got him these for now. I am gonna get him some for uh, when he starts school. So I'm gonna save these. Um, he, he needs a seven to two now. And it's just a three pair. So you just get an all white pair. Well, it has gray on the heel and gray on the toe. And then gray with the black and then the black with the light gray. So, and then I also got him a pair. I think it was red navy blue and then like a black i think um it was also a three pack like this but he already opened it and then today i found some shirts for him so i got him this one it's just gray with red it'll match a couple pairs of shorts that he has so i'll wash these and these can be new shirts that he can wear for school I got him this just solid orange. He looks so cute in orange. It's my favorite color and it's his too. Well, I don't know. He changes his favorite color like every day, but he does say he likes orange. And then I found him this cute baby blue one. So I'll wash these, get them all ready for him and he can have some. Now he'll have five. I looked for Shannon. They didn't have any girl ones. Um, or even any of these in her size. So I'll have to get some more shirts for her. All right, one last thing. This I am gonna, I wasn't gonna show you, but I'll go ahead and show you. 
It's something that's been going around on TikTok. I've been wanting to do it. I'm gonna do it for my husband, not for me. So yes, this looks like a lot of candy, but I'll explain what I'm doing. I don't think this container is gonna work. Um, I don't think it's big enough and I really don't like this lid. It was really hard to lock this lid on there. Um, so I think I wanna pick up one at Target or like Ross or TJ Maxx or something that seals better, but I will use this in the pantry for something if I don't use it for this. So I basically, I'm gonna be making my husband a candy salad um, where you just dump a bunch of different candies in a jar or in a container and you just eat it like that. So I don't think I'm gonna use all of this, but whatever I decide to not use, I'll just stick in the pantry. Um, I know for a fact I'm gonna use these. So it's just the Sour Patch Strawberry, Sour Patch Watermelon, the original Sour Patch Kids, the Blue Raspberry. I didn't get the grape or the peach. My husband doesn't like peach, neither do I. And I didn't know if he liked the grape ones. So I just stuck with what I know he likes. Um, I'm gonna do crawlers I don't I know I'm doing the original ones I don't know if I'm gonna do the berry the very berry ones I haven't decided like I said I I originally wanted to fill this but I don't know if this is gonna be big enough um, so we'll see but I don't know if I'm gonna use these and then I got original trolley or Jolly Rancher gummies and then I got the very berry. So I'll probably use the original. I'll keep the very berry aside. <coughs> and then I got the sour punch bites. You get strawberry, green apple, blue raspberry. And then I got the not so sour punch ones. And you get dream berry, passion punch, grateful grape, and cotton candy. So I was thinking I would save these ones. So like maybe I'll do like a very berry themed one and then do like a regular candy salad unless I can fit all of this in one container. So I'm also going to include this in his get goodie basket. There's not going to be a name on it of anything funny. Um, I've just been wanting to do a candy salad for him for a while because I thought he would like it. So it's just going to be a little extra something for his goodie basket while he's recovering. Um, so, all right, now we're going to get into the fall stuff. So if you don't want to see or if you've seen plenty of fall already, then feel free to click off. That's fine. There's really not a whole lot here. As you saw, I, I got one of each of the gnomes. I couldn't pass them up. You guys know how I am. I collect them. I put them everywhere. So I did not decorate for the 4th of July. I still have my watermelon stuff. Um, I don't know when I'm decorating for fall, probably August. So I got this one. I love his plaid hat. It says fall. He's orange. His feet are green. And then the girl with the braids, she has a little green leaf polka dot hat. And then this guy, he has an orange plaid hat. He's green, yellow feet. I'm gonna keep all the fall stuff in a bag together. And then I got the other girl with the flower or the leaves on her hat. She has braids with little bows. So I got her. I got this really cute little pumpkin sign. This is leather and it says welcome. And then it just has the little jute bow at the top. I love how simple and cute this is. So I got that. I got only one rolling pin. They had three. They had a white one, this orange one, and I think they had a blue one. Um, this one says, hello pumpkin. The white one said falling leaves, I think. And then I don't remember what the third one said, but this was the only one I wanted. 
I didn't go crazy. I limited myself. I just got a few things. So I did get this. Fell in love with that. Love that. That's like Hobby Lobby Michaels right there. I love the two different fonts. Love how they're doing that. And then this one, I had to get this. It says pumpkin punch. It looks like a little maple jar. They also had a apple cider and a mold cider, I think. And it had like cinnamon sticks on it. Um, they were all really cute, but like I said, I didn't want to go crazy. I only got the pumpkin one. I just got the one of what I liked the most. This, these next, um, I only got one of these. It says happy pumpkin spice season. We got that. This one, I did get three, or no, I got two. But I am redoing this one. I don't like anything that says autumn on there. It's just not my thing. I really don't like that name either. No offense to anybody with that name. Um, I'm more of welcome fall, hello pumpkin, pumpkin spice, everything nice. Like I'm more into those sayings for fall than I am about autumn leaves and like stuff like that. I just, it's not my thing. I just don't like it. And I really don't like the background. So I'm gonna pop the little coffee cup off of here and put my own backing, like background. And so I'm gonna just vamp it up a little bit. I love the beads, love the hanger, love the wood look of it, love the little coffee cup, just don't like, it says autumn leaves and lattes please. So like I like the latte part, but I don't like the autumn part. So I'm just gonna change it a little bit. And then I got this one, but I'm not doing anything to it. And it says, pumpkin kisses and harvest wishes. And then they had one with gnomes on it, but it also said something about autumn, so I didn't grab it, I left it there. And then I think they had one more, but I'm not sure. So I just got those two. And I did get this one. I fell in love with the orange plaid pumpkin. And then it has another one that says, hello fall has the raffia bow. So I went ahead and got that. Fell in love with that one. They had a few other designs and colors too. <coughs> and then I almost didn't get these signs because I have so many already for fall, but there was just no way I could not get this one. This one, I, I had to get this one, you guys. It's so freaking cute. It says Farm Fresh Pumpkins, or Farm Fresh Pumpkin Patch, Hay Rides Corn Maze Hot Cider. It does have um, glitter on the word pumpkin patch, and then this part is like 3D. But I love this. It's so cute. I had to get that one. I. I was like, I'm definitely putting that out this year. And then the last two I got, technically only one of these is going to be for fall. Um, this one. And it says, open daily farmer's market, fresh produce, apples, corn, pumpkins, gourds. I love the distressed look. It does have glitter on there, so I will spray it with some hairspray. Um, just fell in love with it. And then this one could be fall. But you guys already know I decorate for um, with sunflowers. So this will be for all my sunflower stuff. And it says pick your own sunflower farm, seeds, stems, flowers, bouquet. And I fell in love with this one too. It's so cute. So that is it for this Dollar Tree haul. Like I said, I mean, it was kind of big, but kind of not. There was just a lot of um, multiples of stuff. And there was, I mean, quite a few fall, fall things. My stores are starting to put out Halloween, but not really anything that I'm looking for right now. And I don't even wanna think about Halloween right now. But anyways, so stay tuned. Like I said, I am gonna be going live tonight. Hopefully I can get this video edited and posted 
before I go live. So I'm going to do that now. Um, since I'm just going to be sitting here relaxing since I don't have the kiddos and enjoying that as much as I can. Um, but I have missed you guys. I can't wait to be live tonight and I'm going to have an awesome giveaway. I'm going to have a coupon code. I have a bunch of new inventory, so I'm super excited. Um, I'm hoping I can at least go a couple nights a week. Not like I was doing before I was going Monday, Wednesday, Friday, but maybe twice a week I could go live and do ring bomb stuff. So you guys will be seeing me a lot more now, now that I'm feeling a lot better. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. I would love for you to be part of my YouTube family if you're not already. And until then, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.